Yeah, hi, uh, how's it going? So, um, I've got these uh, SR60s from Grado. I've had them for, God, a long time, maybe over 10 years. And the ear foam is in really bad shape. Uh, see, it's kind of splitting right here. They're discolored. Uh, they look really ugly. Uh, my wife refuses to wear them because they look so bad. Um, but they still work and sound great. So, um, I can keep wearing them for a while, but they're going to fall apart eventually. The foam is. So, uh, I went on eBay. I did a lot of research. And um, you can buy um, some no-name ear pads that from people you've never heard of. I was afraid that the quality was going to be pretty bad, like it would be really cheap foam or something. So I went on eBay and uh, I got, I just, I got it a few days ago. I'm going to open this up. So I decided to spend a couple extra bucks and get the Sennheiser ear pads. Um, they're for a different model. Um, they're called the HD414. And uh, I thought I would be a lot safer by going with a, a name brand than um, you know some generic uh, foam that from people you've never heard of. So. Um, I got these, plus I think the yellow looks kind of cool. Um, definitely not one of the main reasons why I got these, but um, so uh, let's check it out. Um, the foam is, definitely feels like really good quality. It's uh, fairly, fairly hard closed cell, I guess you would call it. And uh, I've seen pictures of uh, other Grados with these on, so I know they should fit. So let's take these off. And this is what the Grados look like without the earphone. Just, I like, I like the Grados a lot. They sound really good. And I like them because they're basically no frills. Uh, it's plastic housing but the open ear, um, they sound really good. I've, like I said, I've had them for a long time. So the uh, ear foam is smaller than the, the Grados. Um, and it looks like it's, the opening is a lot smaller. So we'll see how it fits. In fact, it's like way smaller. I don't know if I got the wrong ones or not. Um, do I have to cut them out? Huh. Let's just try to put them on and see how it goes. It looks like it might fit, but it's going to be tight. So it looks, I think I'm going to be able to jam them on, even though the opening is way too small. And they do fit on here. And it makes the foam kind of concave uh, due to the way that they're stretched out on the, uh, the back side. But, um, looks okay. Feels okay. Let's try the other one on. I'm going to do some research after this and see if I should have gotten a different, uh, brand. But when I did, uh, when I looked them up online, I typed in Grado, uh, foam or Grado ear pad replacements 
and this is what came up so I assumed it would fit maybe you're supposed to cut them maybe uh, I might I might modify them later but for now I'll just leave them on and the, the foam like I said seems like really good quality and is definitely handling the stretching very well and uh, I really like the way they look the yellow and black I think really kicks butt. See? Great O. And let's try them on. And they feel really good too. Look good, feel good. I think they were like 10 bucks. Let's see what it says on the packing slip. No price. And here it says Sennheiser HD 414 Grado SR Ear Cushions. So I think I got the right ones. And I'm pretty happy. That's like, looks a million times better than this, you know, these old ones. The next trip is see if my wife will use them now. That'll be the true test. Thanks for watching.